Hey Long Beach, in case you missed it, for years the Grunion Gazette has reported on the ups and downs at the Queen Mary, including last year when the city approved $23 million for some urgently needed repairs. Earlier this week, the Press-Telegram reported that it might take much, much more to bring the ship into shipshape condition. Experts say that unless major action is taken soon, there could be serious problems with the ship, including internal structural collapse, in the next decade. The cost of the repairs ranges from $230 $5 million to $289 million. The ship was purchased by the city in 1967. For a period of time, the Port of Long Beach was the owner, along with 54 acres of land around it. But when the port decided to get rid of the icon, the city took it back. While the city owns the ship, it has never operated it. Instead, it has leased it out to several operators, all with plans to save and restore the Queen to its former glory. The current operators, Urban Commons, have promised to renovate the Queen Mary and develop the land around the ship. For more details on this story, watch for Emily Thornton's update on our website, gazettes.com, and in Thursday's printed edition of the Grunion Gazette. I'm Kurt Eichstead. Thanks for watching.